Okay, so this is a continuation of the previous videos where I have finished showing you how to do the APA format running head and I have finished how to um, create an APA title. So one of the things that I mentioned when we created the title style was that it was based on normal format. So when I click here on title and say modify, it says it's based on the normal style. So and I mentioned that that was going to cause us problems, and here's why. The MS, uh, the uh, APA format calls for each paragraph the, to be indented about half inch. So that's the way I define that the indentation is half an inch on the first line of each paragraph. So the easiest way to do that just automatically is to change my normal font to, well, first it needs to be Times New Roman, 12 point double spaced format paragraph and I'm going to say first line indent by half an inch and then also no extra space afterwards. Now the reason that's going to cause us an issue is as soon as I push OK here you see all of these other formats now I've gotten this is normal format this is just the line spacing above the title well as soon as I get down onto the title you see, it is also half inch indented, which means that now my title is no longer centered on the page because it's built on a normal format that has a half inch indent on the first line. So I need to modify my title format paragraph, no indentation, and that will return it back to where it was before I modified the normal font. Same thing with my second line of my title, which is the subtitle paragraph, oh, because it's built on title, sorry. And then the last one is title centered, which is built on normal, and paragraph none. Okay, so now each of these is correctly centered, again, the way it, is, the way it should be, and I've got my normal um, style now has that half inch indent. Again, you can tell the, by the half inch indent by the, by the um, ruler up at the top of the page. So once I get done with, remember I, I had started out by putting a control enter, which is a hard page break, at the end of this line, which then takes me down to the first line of the next page. So I don't have to enter a whole bunch of enter, 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 to get down to here, like I did above this. See how I have a different line above it? Once I get to the end of it, I just hit control enter. Remember, I can go to the paragraph symbol up here and it'll show you, look, there's that page break that I entered. So now I'm down here. The next thing that's going to appear in the APA format is the abstract heading. So it's technically it's not a heading, it's more of an inside title. So I'm going to use the format titled centered for now. But that's not really what I want this to be because even though technically it works, I also like to set up what's going to happen next. So if we go to titled centered and say modify, the style for the following paragraph would be titled centered. Because if I wanted this and then I hit enter, then I want the next one titled centered. I mentioned that on the, um, on the title page video. So now we're here, I'm going to create a new style and I'm gonna base it on titled centered, but the style, um, I'm getting a little ahead of myself. So this new style I'm going to call abstract heading, header, title. How about abstract title? And the only change that I'm going to make to that is I'll come back and revisit the style for the following paragraph. Okay. So right now, I think that's the end of the document. So I'm just going to hit enter. There is no form, or there's no style for the following ab, uh paragraph so it automatically went to abstract title but what I want instead I'm going to put it to normal for now the problem is the first line in APA following the abstract title is not indented every other paragraph is except for the first one following the abstract so I'm going to make a new uh, style called abstract let's just call it abstract first the style is built on normal. The style for the following paragraphs will be normal, but this one, abstract first, I don't want indented 
on the first line. Okay, so now I'm going to go back up to abstract, the abstract title style, and I'm going to say the next paragraph after that I want to be abstract first. So let's delete what we just did. So I'm right there. Now my cursor is right here after abstract. You can see right here the style that I'm on is abstract title. I'm going to hit enter, which is going to take me to the first paragraph of the abstract. And my, full, my style is now abstract first. You can see I'm flush left. So I'm going to open up a website. Um, there is a thing that computer programmers use called Ipsum. Ipsum. Um, I think it's this one that's the one I want. Yes. I'm just going to paste some text into there. And it's nonsensical text. So I'm going to create two paragraphs of Ipsum. Programmers use this because people habitually will read text even if that isn't the point. The point is you just want them to look at the format. They'll read the text anyway. So in this case, the text is not the issue. I just want you to read the format. So I'm going to paste special so I can click the down arrow here and say keep text only. Okay, now in this case it just brought it in as text. I'm going to connect those two paragraphs together and I'm going to hit enter. Oh, that's a bad thing. How come that didn't work? Paragraph, modify. The next one should be normal. If I go to style normal, did I change that? Format, paragraph, first line. How come that didn't indent? As you can see, this is not always 100%. One of the problems with using Ipsum is everything is misspelled. How come that didn't indent? It's showing it as abstract first. It should be going in as normal, in which case it indents. Clearly, sometimes I have to play around with it too to make it work. Let's delete this. I want to see if I can make this work. Okay, so I finished my first paragraph of the abstract and I hit enter. It goes to normal. So it's because I pasted it in. So now if I paste again, um, let's say paste, special, keep text only. Now each subsequent paragraph is going in as normal. Okay, so that is the setup for the abstract. I'm going to pause there because this video took too long and then I will continue with headings and um, references in a fourth and hopefully final uh, video.